Hey everyone, this is Richard Petrillo with workwithrichardp.com. And you know, lately I've had a lot of people asking me how to forward and mask a domain name. So I thought I'd make a little video real quick to show you exactly how that's done. So what I'm going to do is head on over to GoDaddy and log into my GoDaddy account so we can get to the back office. And once we log in, need to go over to the far right hand side and click my account and that'll bring up a new window. And this is going to show you all of your different domain names. I've got several different domain names. I actually have to go in a little further to get to the one that I'm looking for. So I'm going to grab this domain name here, mlmgetnewleads.com and that'll bring me to another new window. And here's the tricky part really because GoDaddy puts so much information on all their web pages it's, it's kind of crazy but you'll need to scroll down all the way to the far left hand bottom left hand corner and you'll find the forward subdomain window okay so I'm gonna run over here and click manage and that's gonna bring us to a new window and you can see I've got a few that I've already forwarded and and masked. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to run over to my MLSP campaign here and pull up the campaign and URL that I want to forward and mask. As you can see my default link is this big long not so pretty URL and there's a different URL for each campaign that you create so I'm gonna click on my newest one Team Beachbody and I don't know if you can see it but it's actually changed the last part of that to its own number so I can track what goes on with this so I need to grab this URL and come back over to GoDaddy and I'm gonna add a subdomain right here now the nice thing about this is you, you buy a domain name, but you can have up to 90 different subdomains. They allow you to do that with this forwarding and, and masking. So it's, it's kind of cool. So what I'll do is click on the add subdomain name. It's going to pull up a window and this is the area the forward this domain to. This is what I took from MLSP. That's what I want to have changed. But there's one very important thing that you need to do here. Notice they have the HTTP set up for you already. Okay, so you need to make sure that when you plug your domain name, I'm sorry, your URL into here, that you delete that part of it and just start out with the www. And where it says add a subdomain, this is what you want that domain to look like when it finally shows up in the URL. So I'm going to call this Team Beachbody. And the actual URL will end up being teambeachbody.mlmgetnewleads.com. Okay. Before we click OK, we can actually do a preview here in this little window. It'll show you the, the website. I don't know if you can get a good clear shot of that, but now I haven't finished this campaign, but at least I know that's the exact website. That's my website that I want to be forwarding. And you want to be sure this is one of the most important things is to click on the uh, advanced option because you want to be able to actually forward with masking. And when you do that, you click on the forward with masking, you have the ability now to come in here and title it, put your description and your keywords in here as well. So all that's connected to the website. So I need to go back over to my Lead System Pro and copy and paste that information. So I'm going to copy and paste the title. We'll put that in here. Run back over and grab the description. This is all part of your SEO so you want to make sure that that's all done properly. And then we've got keywords. So we'll grab the keywords and 
plug that in and you hit OK and that's basically all that's necessary. Now you've got you know a new a URL that you can put out there instead of that great big long one you can design these however you like. Now we just did this it's going to take about 10 to 20 minutes for this to to populate and actually go live so I can't show you that particular one in a live setting but I'm going to click OK and go ahead and log out of GoDaddy. I want to give you an idea of a little better idea of what I'm talking about here. I'm going to go back to my campaign settings and you'll notice that I'm going to click this new skin and it gives me a link for this campaign. So if I plug this into the URL it'll take me to that website and you'll see that I've got this website set up. I put a little video in here to talk directly hey to new skin people but notice that in here the copy says you know do you have what it takes to succeed in your MLM business well because of the S1 variable that uh, we're able to use through my lead system pro that whole masking and forwarding I believe the URL was newskin.getmlmnewleads.com when I click on that now you'll notice that Everywhere in the copy here, instead of MLM business, it says actually says new skin. Have you hit a wall in your new skin business? We've got new skin running throughout this uh, this entire article. Wherever we had MLM through the S1 variable, I was able to put new skin in here. So I'm actually talking directly to people at new skin. Kind of a cool little trick with the S1 variable. Anyway, so that's that's forwarding and masking, and you got a little bonus there with with the S1 variable. If you have any questions, feel free to come on over to my blog and send me a send me an email, and I'll be glad to try and help. All right, thanks. See you in the next video.